Ah, welcome to another airport hotel experience to review. This is the Holiday Inn at London Gatwick. Uh, we stayed in December 2021 and for £89 this included a night for two adults including a breakfast included. Parking was an extra surcharge however I unfortunately don't remember how much the parking costs or whether it what it costs these days. Nonetheless, um, they did allow us to park the car there as we were on a day trip which was amazing. At the time of filming this, all flights were leaving from the North Terminal at Gatwick. However, obviously, normal resumption has um, recommenced. Uh, at this time, there wasn't much in the way of services going. However, the bar had reopened for patrons. As you can see, there's the arrivals uh, at the time we went. Um, so we went and enjoyed uh, a nice drink at the bar. I opted to have a Jack and Coke, as you can see there. Pretty standard uh, drink service, although it was quite pricey on the grounds that um, we were at an airport hotel. So... Yes, keep an eye on that if you ever use one of those. Okay, so I'm going to have a look around the room. Obviously, essential teas and coffees were provided with a kettle and two glasses for water and cold drinks. TV was on offer with the basic channels as well as a writing area, a chair with some to lounge at and two beds. Some interesting Gatwick and travel artwork on display relevant to the theme that this is a Gatwick Airport hotel. And obviously there was a menu for the room service. Uh, in the drawers, there was nothing special in that empty one, though you could use it for storage. A couple of hangers provided, if you should have required that. And in this cupboard, we have an iron with an ironing board, as well as some extra towels. Pretty box standard for a hotel. This was a pretty good stay for one night. And in the toilet, it was your average holiday in experience there. You had uh, a handful of pumps with different uh, forms of conditioner, shampoo, moisturiser, body lotion and hand soap so it was all working order it was all modern as well which is nice to see in a hotel chain these days it ticked all the right boxes and it wasn't far from the airport breakfast was included as i said so you had a nice selection of pastries and cakes and cereals fruit and there were obviously your classic juices you can see those were the three on offer two of those i really enjoyed and there was a small selection of hot foods you could uh, swing between a nice full english selection as well as some more yogurts that it was my uh, choice for the f that particular morning and a nice little yoghurt to round things off. A hotel hopper shuttle is available for Gatwick Airport. It dropped us outside the North Terminal. It does cost extra. It's not included in the hotel, though the hotel does provide a um, pamphlet of the times for you uh, if you need to time to a particular flight. Overall, I will rate this hotel a pretty reasonable and modest score of 11 out of 15.